こんにちは皆さん、はじめまして、マックスです。お願いします。ボンジョーコモタリプシュマペレマックス。よろしくお願いします。Hi, everybody. Welcome back to another brand new live video. For the girls, for the children, and as promised, the Sarah snapshot. Sarah shops a lot. Aristocrat fantasy today. Woo! Snaps for Sarah. <laughs> so, you guys, Sarah is here, and she came in. She wanted stickers. She actually had a very precise design. Like, it was already mapped out. And I was like, come with me to the sticker <laughs> wall. She thought I was joking when we told her I had like 530 stickers. She was like, I only saw three max. <laughs> and then I took her, and how many stickers was there? Over 500. <laughs> Over 500. It took a while. It took probably like close to like half an hour to like go through all the stickers that we. And then we were like going through which ones we were going to use, and we were brainstorming, let's combine this with this, and we we're going to do a, first a flower design, and yes. then we went with stickers that look like real flowers. Yes. And then we saw 3D stickers that had birds, hi! And then we saw one sticker that stole our heart. <laughs> sticker number 520. Again, that sticker number that we're going to be using today is 520, and it is a puss. <laughs> Isn't that adorable? Yeah. So it's inspired by your cat. PETA. PETA. And、uh, this is sticker number 520. So it's very、um, aristocrat design. So a lot of the stuff at Disneyland and at Disney World that I've seen that's aristocrat is so pretty because it's like very like French,、um, Rococo, lacy. They have、yes. such a pretty tea set for the aristocrats. Aww. Yeah, like the, it's like a teacup, but it's like a French teacup, like very Alice in Wonderland with the little pink cat with the ribbon on it. Pinkies up. Yes, I was like, <laughs> I want to buy it, but where would I put it? Because <laughs> that's something you buy that you don't use. Yes. That is the real Mexican way. You buy it and you don't use it. Yep. So I wanted to buy it, but I, I never did. Maybe I'll buy it this year when I go to,、um, to Disneyland on my birthday. Buy me a nice little teapot set. That I won't use ever. <laughs> I'll just have it back here. I'll mix next with like my Power Ranger stuff and my Pokemon and、uh, an Aristocrat tea set. There you go. Hi, she says, I love the Aristocrats. So, I actually never seen the movie.、Um, we're going to use what were these called? Cute Ribbon 3D Charms. <laughs> If I can open them so I can show you guys. Oh my god, you guys. And I had some bad news today. Do you guys want me to show you, share with you the bad news? It's about my health. I already shared it with Sarah. Isn't that adorbs? Who wants to hear the bad news? Let me know in the comments below. I'm going to tell you anyway, but I want to know who pities me. And then we're going to use our <laughs> Opal 3D. What's so funny? Who pities me? Who pities me? That. This is the Opal 3D charm. Isn't that adorbs?、Oh. We're gonna be serving the puss today with little kitty cat number 520. Oh, and then some of these white stickers too. Because Sarah was like, should we do glitter underneath? And there is. Too much is too much. <laughs> so if you put glitter, stickers, and 3D charm, thank you. On top, from far away, it'll all look very、uh, blown out of proportion. And it, you won't have any contrast. You won't be able to. What we want to stand out is the cat, PETA. So, <laughs> if we gotta keep the base neutral so that way all the other stuff we're gonna put on there gives it a nice little. So, they wanna hear the bad news. The bad、yes. news is, it turns out I have a fatty liver. I'm like, doctor, from where? Like, my rib is sticking out. Look at that. <laughs> like, see? Where is this fatty liver coming from? And he's like, do you drink a lot? I, I don't drink any alcohol. Should I start? <laughs> He's like, could it be some of the supplements you're taking? So maybe it's my fiber or my like apple cider vinegar. Maybe that's giving me fatty liver. Yeah. Because the only day, the only time of day that I have like something that's really fatty is for breakfast. Because I have to have my hash browns. Like my mom will make me breakfast and I'll ask her, did you make my hash browns? I need my hash browns, mom. <laughs> If not, I'm not having breakfast. Make me my hash browns. So, they told me to consume more protein. And my face is swollen today because I had my Pico treatment and it really like makes, you, makes your face a little irritated. But it didn't hurt at all, which is good. She's like, it's the Gatorade. <laughs> I hope it's not. 
Because I love me my Gatorade. <laughs> Hash browns and Gatorade. Hash browns and Gatorade. <laughs> I should be from like uh, Alabama or something. <laughs> I love me my Hash browns and I love me my Gatorade. <laughs> but wouldn't my glucose be higher if I if from the sugar from the Gatorade? Mm -hmm. Not so much a fatty liver. Is there sugar? I know there's sodium in it. Yes. But it's so delicious. I love me my Gatorade, and I love me my Powerade, my blue Powerade, and my purple. <gasps> purple Powerade is so good. Oh my gosh. If you guys have not had... You like grape drink. Huh? You like grape drink? What's grape drink? Purple Gatorade. <laughs> oh, yes. It's delicious. High blood pressure. Yes, I've heard of that. There is a lot of, actually, total sugars is 48 grams. So... <laughs> But it's so delicious. And it's not alcohol. So. It's not alcohol. But why are you ruining me, Gatorade? And I can't do Gatorade Zero. That tastes disgusting. I drink whiskey every night and my litter is thin. <laughs> <laughs> your litter or my your liver. liver? Sorry, I'm in the cats. <laughs> the cat zone. So we're going to use Black Label. One, two, three, go. Um, stiletto long. Sculpted stiletto long. Max, I have the protein drink for you. What's a protein? Like a like a shake? But that's like for gym people, right? Could be for anybody. I don't want to get fat from drinking protein. Well, protein is just a replacement. So you will replace a meal with your protein. But I like eating. Well, I mean, I don't like eating, but I like, I like consuming my food. You like to chomp. Yes. <laughs> and I was like, every day I have a salad. So I, like, where is this fatty liver coming from? And I try, I try to cook with coconut oil. I tell my mom, cook with coconut oil. Because that's the kind. Of, what supplements do you take? Jeez. I take oh dandelion God. because that's good for water retention. I take fiber. I take L-carotene. I take glutathione. I take <laughs> apple cider vinegar. I take uh, fiber. A facilium husk, I think. And what else do I take? I think that's it. Oh, and diet pills. But I'm not going to tell the doctor to take diet pills. Because then he's not. <laughs> I'm going reti to retain that information from him. Well, maybe so, that's where the fatty liver is from. From the diet pills? Maybe. Well, I will guess I'll die with the fatty liver. <laughs> I need my pills. I need my drinks and my smokes. My hash browns and my Gatorade. I need my hash browns, <laughs> my Gatorade, and my diet pills. You can't take those away from me. You can snatch them out of my cold, dead, unliving hands. <laughs> So, we are going to look at that, you guys. Poor Sarah, she had an accident, legit. I fell. She fell, shaking the puss. <laughs> she was giving her cat d a drunken baby syndrome. <laughs> so, let's go in with Diamond Manny to begin etching. Oh, no, let's use a hardware bit, because hardware bit is very soft and gentle. And look, ugh, if you guys don't have one of these for your bits, invest in one. And did you guys like the little video I did this morning for the pedicure set? So that way, everybody can snatch up their own little toesies. And so cute. What's everybody saying, Miss Sarah? I don't know. My thing stopped. I'm going to have to redo it. Give us one second, you guys, because it wouldn't be a max video unless there was technical difficulties. And don't forget, you guys, right now we have our 20% off promo code. It's almost over. Spread the cheeks and the rice. Oh, who told me yesterday to watch season five, The Fight of the Real Housewives of Potomac with Candace and another girl named Monique? Because, girl, I did that yesterday. <laughs> I was like, I'm curious to see. And, ooh, she, the MVP of that fight was Candace's wig because it did not come off. <laughs> so now I have to watch season five of The Real Housewives of Potomac once this reunion is over. So that way I won't be, like, confused about the timelines. But I'm really surprised she's not coming back. Did you hear that? No. Candace is not coming back to the next Aww. season of Real Houses of Potomac. Which is shocking. Yeah, it is. Because she really, like, um, used it as a platform for, like, her music career and acting. So yeah. She did really good. Is it working? Yeah, it's working. Amy Jewel says, I've been thinking about getting the pedicure set. Glad you showed it. Yeah, and it's only um, ten ninety nine for the pedicure set. Plus a 20% off discount that you can use on um, promo code GREEN20. So it's a great time to get a pedicure set from InnoCouture.com. IB Rocking says, I need a French tip, toe tip set to match my 1, 2, 3, go French tips. Um, the Ultra Mini French nails make great toe tips too because they're very tiny little nails. 
tiny little sport phalanges. Betty D says, morning, Max. Happy Good Friday here. Happy Good Friday. Ha What's today? Thursday what? Uh, Holy Thursday. Holy Thursday. It is Holy Week. My mom this morning, she was like, don't turn on any music. Today was the day that Jesus was crucified. Yep. She was serious. Yes. Again, one more time, just to make sure we don't have any dry non-living tissue on the phalange. Get those sidewalls nice and snatched. Nice and snatched. Blue said, hi, love you. I love you more. Thanks for joining us today, lovely. Uh, Kahira Creation said it was Ricky. Ricky said that about the, the fight? Mr. Ricky Loop, that fight was iconic. That wig did not come off because she had it. Ooh, she had a death grip on that wig. Nadine said, I received my one, two, three, go nails today. Awesome. I hope you love them, lovely. But why was there a beef between Monique and Candace? Can somebody elaborate on that? Because I have not seen that season. This is my first time watching Real Hustles of Potomac. Cindy Chris said, I was looking at your stories when the live popped up, so you will have to, so we'll have to finish watching later. Well, I have posted a lot of stories. Keeps the girls busy. So we're going to go in now with our famous skinny sanding bands and mandrels. Yes, I had a very busy morning today. I had to wake up really early because I had to go to get my Pico laser. And then my mom wanted to go have breakfast at Toast 101, but Ooh. I don't like that restaurant. It honestly, it looks very dirty. Like it's, it just has like a a vibe of it dirty. I don't know why. Have you been to Toast One? I've never heard of it. No. Uh -uh. It. Oh, I don't know. I didn't like it. That coffee was disgusting. Some of the worst coffee I've ever had. I like First Watch. Oh, that's what we ended up having. I, I like it there. I had the shrimp and grits, and it was actually pretty good. They have a really good Gary A cheese and ham sandwich. Mm -hmm. When you do a lunch special, and you get a. Broccoli cheddar soup. And they close pretty early too, don't they? Yeah, I think like at two. Anita Dad said, I ordered the toe tips today. Got to get ready for sandal season. She is ready. Maybe this year will be the year I do a video on toe tips. But I need a model that I won't, uh, I can feel comfortable doing her feet. Cindy Even though I used to do a lot of pedicures back in the day. Did you? Mm-hmm. Did I never did yours? No. Oh. You tell me, I don't touch feet. Really? <laughs> yes. Cindy Grace said, one digit sugar is ideal, so anything over 10 is very high, let alone 48 grams in a Gatorade. Mm. But it's so delicious. <laughs> and then I was talking with the girl that did my uh, facial, and her, she has a very particular last name. And I was like, do you know Gabriella Dabadu? And she's like, that's my cousin. And I was like, oh my gosh, what a small world. And then we were talking about the Madonna concert and who I saw at the Madonna concert too. Do you know who Eskidios is? Oh, you saw locals over there? Yeah. Oh, I love that when I see people from here at other places. And it's like kind of surreal, isn't it? Yeah. He didn't say hello to me, but one of the girls that was with him did. Because I know her. I used to do her nails way back in the day. Aww. But he didn't. But I was like, that's okay, Pennywise. <laughs> you don't have to say hello. I'm scared anyway. I saw a coworker at a Phoenix mall and I was like, what the heck? What are you doing here? Uh-huh. That was weird. It's like seeing a teacher a outside of school. Lace. Yes. <laughs> Wax Girl said, hello, my love. Hi, lovely. Thanks for joining us today. Now we're going to go in with a little bit of nail prep. That's funny, Pennywise. Aussie Mate said, how do I find the heart dish you put uh, your crystal in? Um, just type in on the search bar on the website. Just type in heart-shaped sorting tray. That is her name. And you shall find her. She is waiting for you. And don't forget at checkout, use promo code. Green 20. Oh, Sarah, I'm going to show you something. <laughs> you ha you're going to gag when you see it. It's the Neon Pigment Set. This is limited edition. It's coming out for the summer. I can't wait to use this on you. And you can also use this as makeup. <gasps> oh, that is awesome. That's very you, isn't it? I saw a secret. I saw a secret. So let's measure our black label stiletto. 
E3 Virgo said, hi, Max. Hi, everyone. Hi. Thanks for joining us today. Ooh. Remember, we want to fit the nail like Ariana Grande says, side to side. As you might say, thank you. You're welcome, my lovely. Are you going to go see um, Hairspray? They're coming to Tucson. I love any musical. I love Hairspray, but I couldn't find any seats within the four, first four rows. And that's where I wanted to sit. Mm -hmm. What about MJ? Did you go? No, I'm not a big fan of Michael. Aww. Did you go see the MJ musical? No. No? Mm -mm. That makes two of us. When was it? It's now, I think. Oh, it's now? Yeah. Oh. They didn't do a very good job advertising it, huh? And Shrek was, like, only two days. Oh, yeah. I heard about that, but I didn't go see that. It's just so inconvenient because it's in the middle of the week. Well, that's because it's Tucson. Yeah. <laughs> we don't have a choice. We're no. lucky we get any. I know. But, I, oh, my gosh. The Madonna concert sold out. There was not anywhere to s stick a needle in. It was packed. You had great seats. Yes, I did. I was very lucky. And they weren't too bad for the price. It was about 400 bucks for the ticket, but I mean, it's Madonna. It's Madonna. But the whole time I was like, oh my gosh, please, Lord, let this concert end soon so I can go poop. I paid 500 for uh, Bruno Mars in Vegas. So, really? Yeah. Was it a good seat? It was second row. Oh, wow. Yeah. So you really saw Bruno Mars, huh? Yes, he has little feet. Like some really? <laughs> I would imagine he has little hands, like, yes. little, very, like little empanada hands. I saw all his footwork right in my face. Really? Mm -hmm. His sweat? Yeah, he's pocket sized. Really? Was yeah. he nice? Yes. So handsome. So talented. He's what, Polynesian? Yeah, he's a couple of things. Like Polynesian and Filipino, I think, I, right? Yes. For the longest time, I thought he was Puerto Rican. Yeah. But no, he's a um, tropical person, huh? Mm hmm. So we're going to go in with clear press on gel as our base. Base, base. It's all about that. What, have you heard the rumors about him having a gambling addiction? No. Yes. That he owes like MGM like fifty thousand dollars, <gasps> so he's probably going to be headlining an MGM arena really soon. That's where I saw him. Really? I saw him at MGM Park. Oh, so maybe he will uh, be in. He, maybe he is indebted oh, to MGM. So he performs for free for them. <laughs> he's like, I got to pay off my debt. Wow. Because fifty million dollars is a lot of money to gamble. Boo creamy nail says, "Hey Max." Hi. Hi. Thanks for joining <laughs> us today. Oh, you know where I'm going tonight? One of my cousins is here in town with her husband and her daughter. They came shopping. And she's like, do you want to come shopping with us? I was like, I have to live stream at 3. Well, that's what the time my model's getting here. And I'll probably be done around 6. So I can see you guys after. And we're like, oh, okay, let's meet for dinner. Nice. Because honestly, I hope she's not watching this. I don't like shopping with her husband. <laughs> He's the kind of person that's like, let's see how much cotton is in this shirt. Because if it's not at least 100% cotton, I'm not going to wear it. Because uh, I don't like it. Like, calm down, dude. <laughs> You're at an outlet in Tucson. <laughs> this ain't no Rodeo Drive. Cindy Chris said, starry pants today. Love it. These are, because I had to wake up early. I put on some track pants because I was ugh, trying to get up. Let's bake these bad boys. Go ahead and put it in, my lovely. Let's go in with clear booby gum gel. If I can find it. If not, we can use Cool Pink. She's pretty. Oh, my sister's on. Hi, sissy. Hi. Thanks for joining us today. Is she ready to go spread the puss? Is she yes, going to go with she us? she is. She just turned 50. Really? Yesterday. Yep. Spread that 50-year-old puss. Woo -woo. She is ready for the fantasy. And the nastiness. The rumors and the nastiness. <laughs> and the wig pulling uh -oh. with Candace and Monique. Snatch that wig. For reals. That wig was on there for dear life. I was surprised. I was like, they did a good job. On The Real Housewives of Potomac season five, there was a fight between Candace Dillard and this other girl named Monique, who's not on the show anymore. And she got Candace by the hair, and that wig did not come off. Maybe it wasn't a wig. Uh, no, it was. I would have been the same way too. I was like, <laughs> I would have held on to my hair. Did she have the right to or no? What? Uh, I don't know where they were fighting. It's not clear to me because I never saw that Everyone season. Everyone has the right to pull someone's weed. Every, if you poke the bear, mm -hmm. it will growl. It will growl or <laughs> get a really nasty fight. We're going to use the newest bubble gum gel, which is Miss Cool Pink. As you guys saw, I used my famous hand sanitizer prior, so that way I can touch it and not have any issues.
touch, touch, touch. Keep keep it nice and thin on the sides. Oh, so we're gonna go to Pinnacle Peak. Have you ever been to Pinnacle Peak I love before? Pinnacle Peak. Really? You should come with. Are you gonna wear a tie? Girl, I'm wearing sweats. You gotta wear or at least take a tie. If you get a chance to go to Goodwill real quick and buy a tie. Oh, that storm smells funny. Oh, they cut it. Okay. Yeah. Really? Have you been to um, Pinnacle Peak Round Face? I've been there a lot, actually. Oh, excuse me. Thanks for inviting me. Well, now it's cool to be a cowboy. <laughs> this ain't Texas. <laughs> no, his song is, I'm a cowboy, baby. Ride all night because I sleep all day. <laughs> cowboy, <Some> baby. <laughs> okay. I can smell a pig from a mile away. <laughs> Because round face smells like a pig. Uh oh. Smells like bacon? He nice. smells like bacon and pork chops. Come back here. I want to sniff them. Round face. They want to smell you. Apple wood smoked bacon. Ooh. Nails by Mermaid said, hello, sir. The mermaid has arrived. Hello. Direct from Central California. She is serving us the alchemy in the Fantasia. So we are using cool pink bubblegum gel. Press, press, press. Remember, you guys, keep it thin at the cuticle, thicker at the tip. And then we're ready to slap these bad boys on. Because it's bad boy for life until the feds come in. Wax Girl says, we have a Pinnacle Pete's in San Dimas, California. Is that a steakhouse as well? Nails by Mermaid said, black max seed oil helps boost memory. What is it? Black Mac Seed. Mm -hmm. What's that? Black Seed Oil helps boost memory. I'm going to have to look into that. Maybe I'll give my dad some. Well, yes, because I had asked her what alternatives there is. She said it's a very potent remedy. You should incorporate as well lots of amazing health benefits, including immunity. Oh, what about for fatty liver? Because I just found out today I got a fatty liver. I feel like my life is over. He was like, do you take a lot of ibuprofen or drink? And I was like, no. Nails Anthony says, hi, Max. Hi, lovely. Thanks for joining us today. Can we just let people know that is not dookie on my finger? It is a bruise. <laughs> From the club. From the club. Today we are joined by the Katie Price of America. Sarah snaps <laughs> a, shops a lot. You really are like the Katie Price. Yes. He should tell you who Kitty Price is. <laughs> She's like a cross between Pamela Anderson and Kim Kardashian. Ooh. And a lot of spray tan. But she's such a good mom, though. Just like you. Aww. She actually has a child that um, has a really, really bad um, developmental and um, mental and physical disabilities. And the father, when she found out she was pregnant, the father of the child told her to terminate the pregnancy. And she said, no, I'm going to keep it. I'm going to raise him by myself. And that's what she did. His name is Harvey. Aww. I think he, now he's living by himself because he's a big boy. And he's really strong. And because of his like issues, she also is like, she fears a little bit of the, um, uh, the physical violence and things like that. Because she said that he's like punched walls uh, and left holes and things like that. Which yeah. is very, very hard on My everybody. My doctor told me to get rid of the pregnancy really for which kid for the youngest one that really <gasps> and look at that you're like no i'm gonna keep this i'm keeping my baby I'm like madonna yes she's gonna <laughs> keep my baby oh, oh. miss uh, jackson says yes getting my max fix for today come through box girl said yeah and cut your tie so maybe it's a franchise, and does it look like a little old western town? Yeah, our Pinnacle Peak has like a carnival in the front and little stores, some western stores where you could buy like those old cigarette candies that blow Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's like that. I'm surprised they still make that. I'm surprised nobody said like this is bad for the children. My children love me to buy those. They're like, buy some more, Mom. Paul Malls. Nails by Mervate said, the prophet Muhammad once said, it can cure anything but death. Very Ooh. ancient Middle Eastern herb with many benefits. Look it up and buy some when you get off live. That sounds right up my alley. If you tell me it'll make me lose weight, sign me up. So it's black seed oil, huh? Yes. 
I'll Google it right now while she's baking these bad boys. Look at that length and that shape. She is serving it, honey. We are going to seal the inside with Miss Wonder Gel. And Nails Anthony says, love Katie Price. She's everything. She's so iconic. Yeah, babe. That's what Harvey says. <laughs> Ozzy Mate says, fresh lemon juice squeezed in very warm water. First thing in the kitchen is good with fatty liver. It helped me. She might have meant in the morning. Yeah, the like kitchen. in Ayunas. Yeah. How do you say Ayunas in English? Oh, I have no Empty idea. stomach. Oh, yeah. So we're going to seal the inside with a little bit of Wonder Gel. Wax Girl said, yes, exactly the same. Okay, so I guess it must be a franchise. I thought Pinnacle Peak was just a Tucson A Tucson thing, thing yeah. yeah. That's cool. Because they're going to go to Phoenix. They're only going to spend one night in Tucson. Like the song says, one night in Bangkok and the world's your oyster. One night in Tucson and the <laughs> world's your saguaro. Nails by Mermaid said, yes, if helps with weight loss too. I take it every day for... Uh, very good for the lungs as well. So many benefits. My mom has hypo, I'm sorry, hypothyroidism, mm -hmm. and it helps her with that as well. And you guys know that Miss Mermaiden has one of the most famous pair of legs in all of America. But thankfully, all my man hormones were good. Because you guys know I'm a huge advocate. Was that hot? No, it's not on. Oh. No? Mm -mm. Oh, maybe I need to plug it in. Because uh, I hate giving blood work, but all my man hormones came out good. Low estrogen and all that jazz. There we go. Prostate. The doctor's like, I'm going to check your prostate soon. I was like, no, you didn't. No. <laughs> no gracias, senor. No dinner? No dinner first? No dinner. Can we do four, floor, floor play? <laughs> um... What an um, awkward Bay, and uncomfortable thing. Pepe Bay says, hi, Matt. Hi, lovely. Gracias for sintonizar ahora. And Nails by Mermaid said, aw, shucks, sir, I'm blushing. It's like Tina Turner. No, thicker than Tina Turner. Like Becky. Do you remember Becky? Becky with the good hair? No, from my nail shop, <laughs> Becky. That was married to Daryl. Oh, I remember Daryl. And he would sit there and go, <sighs> <laughs> like a dragon. Let's see. We're almost done baking. Shake and bake. Beautiful. I'm already a kitty. How do they feel? Tap them, tap. Love it. Yep. Yes. Let's do the inside upside down, just 30 seconds inside the lamp, just to make sure that we polymerize everything nice and rock hard, just how Sarah likes it. Yes, I like it rock hard. Ro and if not, then it's a no-go. It's a no-go. No cowboy. And NYC says before Wonder Gel. What was the question? Don't know. Could you reiterate the question, my lovelies? Get our refined bit and where's my easy bit? Uh, Mermaid said that's so good. It's important to keep your keep your operating system at its best. At its best, or else you're gonna end up with a hoe like Mia, and she's gonna cheat on you because her husband couldn't perform. Oh, my friend Cynthia's on. Hi, Hi. Cynthia. Did you see that on the on the finale of Real Housewives of Potomac? No, what happened? So Mia. Uh, Crater Face Mia's husband had prostate cancer and he said, you know what? I'm gonna let you um, See someone but I'm gonna give you two uh, Conditions one is you have to be discreet um, You can give them to Ralphie or you can make them if you want I'm going oh. to go practice uh, Oh, excuse <laughs> me <laughs> um, Yeah, just put them on Ralphie's desk Can you pass me my easy bit that I have right there, please? It's right there in the little corner. Mm -hmm. So, yes, thank you. Um, they were having a discussion, and he's like, I, I'll let you, you know, see someone else for, for, for that. 
but you have to be discreet and don't get the kids involved. Mm. And what did she do? No. That is never a good... No. Uh, Nails, Anthony says, loving the shape of these. Aren't they snatched? Bye. My fatty liver. Oh, he said I had to drink more water. And I was like, can I drink water with Crystallite or water with Gatorade? Can I dilute Can I dilute my Gatorade? And he's like, no, just plain water. And I was like, ew. Aww. No. Was this before or after I brought you a caramel frappuccino? <laughs> before. Because I texted him in the morning. And usually they reply to me really fast. So I can go in for my prescription tomorrow. And then they didn't reply because I asked him, I was like, oh, you know, how, how did my um, blood work come out? Because I know that no news is good news in the medical field. Yes. Because if something's bad, they'll usually tell you. Right away. Yeah, yeah, exactly. But when I asked, I didn't get a reply. So I called. And then they're like, well, Brian is uh, with a patient right now, but Luis can talk to you. And I was like, that's fine. And then I was like, oh, my God, I'm going to die. I know it's not in no kind of STI because that, oh, yeah, no. that department is non-existent. Okay, well, you got some feedback. Uh, Mermaid says, LMAO, no max, high quality, plain H2O. Ugh. Cindy Chris said, water with lime or lemon if you need a little flavor in there. What about um, a pack of Crystal Light with caffeine? <laughs> Cinemaca says, buy a water diffuser or what's, infuser. What's that? Mermaid said, herbal iced tea is the only exception. Really? But doesn't iced tea dehydrate you instead of hydrate you? I know, it makes you go pee a lot. Yeah. Well, water does that too, doesn't it? Yeah. So I'm going to go in with a refined bit and we're going to begin to blend out the cuticle area. Mermaid says, they have iced herbal tea bags. Like sun tea? And Nina Sky said, hi, Max. Hi, lovely. Thanks for joining us today. How are you doing? Mermaid said, non-caffeine herbal only. Exclamation. That's too many rules. <laughs> I'm telling you, I drink whiskey every day and my liver is great. Top notch. Top notch. Top notch. Shout out to Jack Daniels. <laughs> She's like, that's how I get through my days. Takes the edge off. Uh, let me know if you need my address for PR. <laughs> <laughs> Send me a little knickknack, a little gifty gift. A little barrel. <laughs> a little barrel of the whisk. Uh, let's see, you got some more feedback. Wax Girl said, uh, caffeinated drinks dehydrate you. And uh, Kay Kush said, get the circle. What's the circle? And uh, uh, Mermaid said, no black tea. Uh, no black tea. The caffeine is the diuretic but that's what makes it taste good <laughs> and that's the only kind of tea i like some english breakfast tea well you like the tea with the lemon and lemonade in it too which one's that one your what is it uh, arnold palmer oh that's black tea with lemon tea yeah. it all comes back to the black tea it's really good because once you go black you can't go back that's right mm -hmm. tail so, as old as time tail as old as time <laughs> strong as it may be no, and just friends. Beauty and the Beast. Sarah and the Beast. Oh, yeah. Mermaid said, I have some amazing herbal teas you would like. Cindy Chris said, the caffeine in tea is very little. Oh, see, there you go. Thank you, Cindy. Thank you for uh, encouraging <laughs> me with my tea. <laughs> so we're going to use the famous Easy Bit to really airbrush that cuticle in. And you guys know the Easy Bit is a triple X fine. So it's an extra, extra, extra fine drill bit to make sure we don't have any product stuck to the skin and we just get a really beautiful snatched phalange fantasia for our aristocrat fantasy today. Mermaid said, Tiesta tea makes a bomb mango pineapple herbal tea. Does it taste good though? She said it was bomb. But it doesn't have any sugar in it. How is it sweetened? They're natural sweet. Uh, mango and pineapple, they have natural sweet. Um, Natural sugars, sugars in there. Yeah. They have no caffeine, she said. And Wax Girl says, once you go bald, you never go back. Ooh, no. Get it. <laughs> I think hair is so important. Hair is like currency for some people. <laughs> like for me. And me. 
Pool. Watch girl said once you go well no she already said that. K Kush said it's it's a water infuser bottle, has different flavors and it's good for dehydration. Oh. Like sometimes yeah. you go to fancy hotels and they have those water things with, with like strawberry and lemon and mint. Oh yeah. But that water tastes disgusting. Look at that blend, you guys. And so now I'm gonna drop my machine speed down to about nine thousand RPM. I'm gonna go around one more time just to make sure. I have that really airbrushed cuticle look that Sarah loves. Nails Anthony says, I'm biased. I love good English tea. Uh, I love a good cuppa. With cream and sugar. A scone. Oh, yes. A crumpet with clotted cream, please. Mermaid said, ooh, yeah, it, is. it does. You need to trust me, sir. When you have... I." When have I steered you wrong? Never. She cannot. It's not in her, in her cyst, in her being. It is not possible. Johnny Rockets joined. Oh, hello, sir. You stand out of trouble. Cindy Chris said, no sugar, Max. Get you some good stevia if you like sweet. Ugh, it tastes like medicine. Mermaid said, the black seed oil will get your liver in shape real quick. I will buy some today, I promise. Along with Princess Peach for Nintendo Switch. <laughs> Have you played that game yet? I don't play games. No, but it's Princess Peach. <laughs> it's so cute. Diamond Love says hello. Hi, lovely. Thanks for joining us today. And Faree said, I'm an early gray girl or London fog. Ooh, come through British tea, uh, tea time. I guess I'm the only drinker. <laughs> the gentleman drinks tea as well. He loves his cups of tea. Aww. His little milk bones. I call him, would you like a cup of tea, gentlemen? Johnny Rocket said, what color, Matt? The category today is um, aristocrat pus. So we're doing pussycats. In honor of PETA. It is totally different from what we originally had planned. Because <laughs> we went from the Picasso flowers to the real looking flowers to 3D flowers. And then we saw the cat and we just both were uh, enthralled with the little kitty cat. Fantasia. Meow, meow, meow. You remember that commercial with the meow 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 What capture was that? Meow mix? Meow mix! Mermaid said, oh my god, yes, I saw it and I was geeking. Who is calling? Oh, Mermaid has a Princess Peach tattoo. She does? Have you played the Princess Peach video game? And K Kush said, Disney Dreamlight Valley is my game. Oh, I have not played that yet. Um, I had originally ordered it for pre-order, the Princess Peach game, but I don't know if you guys remember, I had an issue with one of my credit cards that I had these uh, fraudulent charges on there, and uh, I had to reorder it, so I don't get the pre-order anymore. They had ran up $12,000 in Uber charges. Oh my god. From what city? It didn't say. <gasps> but in one day, there were 72 Uber transactions. I was like, I like my Uber Eats, but it's not that serious. And then the weird thing was that my Uber Eats is connected to a different card versus the one that they, was oh, being used. Oh, wow. Yeah, no. Uh, Mermaid said from Super Mario 2, LOLs. The OG Princess Peach. Fairy said, yes, Dreamlight Valley, love it. That's a cute game. I believe it's free to play. Uh, Johnny Rocket says, I want the nastiness and the fantasies. <laughs> He's ready. Cinemaka says, Meow Mix, yeah. Fairy said, Meow Mix, too. Round Mix. Meow Mix. Round Face has a cat. Aww. What's her name, Round Face? Paquitas. Oh my god, Pita and Paquitas need to meet. Paquitas, and she has a dress. So does Pita. Really? I'm buying her a quinceanera dress because she'll turn 15 next year. <gasps> She's oh going to have a quinceanera, yes. Like in human years? Yes. Oh my god. Cats can also live um, uh, a few a She few years. has a stage 2 liver disease. Aww. You guys something, you have something in common. With uh, <laughs> the kitty cats. 
Uh, Mermaid says she has a lot of Nintendo tattoos, actually, especially on her arms. Come through Nintendo tattoos. We're going to go in with... Let's, should we do a semi-sheer pink? Yeah, why not? We're going to go in with a pink, iconic, number one. Because Sarah, she's still my number one. Kpo Nails or K-pop Nails says, oh my gosh, I got my scoops. Thank you for the generosity. You're welcome, my love. And thank you so much for supporting American companies and American manufacturing like us here at Inocouture.com. Uh, isn't this like a beautiful semi-sheer nude? Oh, you see what they're looking for, Juan? Yes, yes, yes. Um, E3 Virgo says, so I've had my nails on a week now, but I haven't done the design. Should I do a layer of base or a clear press on? Um, buff your nail to remove it. First cleanse it and then buff it. Make sure everything is nice and buffed. And then um, you could probably do a little coat of base coat. And that would help fill in any gap if you have any. Cindy Chris, are they going to do more liver tests on you? Um, no, he's like, it's not too, too high, but it's like a little bit. Like, I think he said the average is like 5.7 and I was at 5.9. Do you have liver problems, man? Yes, I have a fatty liver. It's because of the O. No. <laughs> and he's like, are you in a high dose of some agglutide? And I was like, dude, I take a whole syringe. You're skinny enough, man. I'm not. Stop was, patronizing me, round face. He's not skinny. He has a fat liver. He's a fatty liver. Exactly. If I was skinny, I would not have any fat on me. Thank you very much. You would die if you didn't have any fat on you. No, I wouldn't. Your body will literally consume you if you had no fat on That'd you. That'd be kind of cool to see, actually. <laughs> <laughs> like a vortex or something. Mermaid said, I gotta head out, Max. Sending love your way. I'll check back in soon. Don't forget the black seed oil. Black seed oil. Was well, that what you did today, Max? What? No, I went in, um, I had a laser on my face. She said, and stay away from high fat foods. Well. I hope she's not talking about There goes my mom's hash cooking. Hash browns. <laughs> I, I, if I don't have a hash brown, that is not a good day. And your oh, yeah, I love, ugh. Um, Oscar Mayer wieners, the ones with the cheese inside. Oh, they still make so those? So good. I used to like those when I was younger. So good. E3 Virgo says, I already buffed them. Thanks, Max. You're welcome. Mermaid gave you XOXO. King of Bling says that color is pretty. Isn't this color everything? This is a pink numero uno for the number one girl. The number one girl in my life, Sarah Snapshot. You're my number one, Sarah. Yay, you're my number one. Diamond or else. Love says huh? milk thistle. Uh, Ortiz. Milk thistle is good for your liver. Really? When I was in China, people would ask me to send them uh, milk thistle. What is that? I don't know, some supplement. Oh. I do eat a lot of Chinese food when I eat out. Maybe I that's why. I love Chinese food. My mom says that either I should marry a Chinese um, person mm -hmm. or I should have been born to a Chinese mother. And I was like, I don't disagree with you there. Yeah, my son's upset with me that his father wasn't black. <laughs> why? Because he wanted a black father. Or Brad Pitt, and I did not give him either. Really? Yeah. You disappointed as a mother. I guess. You let him down. Uh, Cinemaka says hash browns are delish. I, but a hash brown patty. Not like the, the Denny's kind of hash browns. Those are gross. Kay Kush says only hot dogs I'll eat so yummy. Oh my god, they're iconic. Cindy Chris says keep it on, track, on check, Max. Maybe in a few months... To see how it's going. He said in two to three months, blood work again. Oh my gosh. Wax Girl asked, what's in the pink jar? Oh, uh, monomer. And E3 Virgo says, with the crazy four-year-old running around, it takes me a while to get a design done. I can imagine. But it's your little break time. Little me time. What do you do for me time, Sarah? I, if, hopefully Johnny Rocket's came off um i shop a lot <laughs> hence the name go ahead and put that in i like to buy things too i like perfumes i like makeup i like skincare i got my eye cream today yes i got my powdered face wash from Yay. japan um what else did i buy princess peaches 
<laughs> no, it's Princess Peach. Peaches is my dog. Aww. My other hairless dog. Would you ever pierce your ears? No. I don't want to look like a lesbian. Would you ever get No offense to any of my lesbians watching. Huh? Would you get pierce your face? No. Dermal? No. That's like putting a bumper sticker on a Aston Martin. That's what Johnny tells me when I want tattoos. He's like, you don't put a bumper sticker on a caddy. A caddy? I don't know what that is. Jeez, can he put you... <laughs> Why did he make you such a cheap car? <laughs> he should have said like an Aston Martin, a Rolls Royce, a Bentley. No, I'm a caddy. A Cadillac. I'm a Cadillac. You're not wide. <laughs> you haven't seen me from behind? He can be a Ford Pinto then. <laughs> I do not ha actually no. I take that back. I do have tattoos. Can we see? Yeah, you've seen them before. Well, for the fantasies, we'd like to see the pink army wants to see it live. So now I'm going in with a ultra thin coat of shiny gel because I'm going to seal the nail so that way I have a beautiful smooth surface to apply my stickers. You guys have seen my tattoos. Cinemarcus says Trader Joe's hash brown patties. Oh, so good. Cindy Chris said same. And Wax Girl asked Monomer to prep your brush. Um, yes, Monomer, literally, she does it all. And Nina asked, what color is that? A pink numero uno, my lovely. Cindy Chris said, I did my design in on one hand and not the other. She's halfway there. <laughs> we have the same tattoo too, Sarah. Well, which one do we share? Our eyebrows. Oh, that's right. I'm too much of a prude. I'm too much of a square <laughs> to get tattoos. Even yeah. my mom has a tattoo. You got a tattoo on your face. That's not a square. That's hood. That's real OG, a teardrop. <laughs> um, on my elbows, uh, spider webs. Nice. That's hot. Loose Forever says, making my nails tomorrow with what I got on my scoop. Ooh, fun! Okay, let's bake these bad boys now for one minute. Even just like that, they look so pretty and natural, don't they? This is giving us very natural. It's not Sarah, but it's just, she's giving. <laughs> E3 Virgo says he's talking about his eyebrows. Yeah, Correct. you're right. And Alsa Lopez, your eyebrows, right, Max? Mm-hmm, which um, I need to get them redone when I go back home to go see my, my, uh, my father, a.k.a. my plastic surgeon in South Korea. <laughs> Diamond Love says this shape looks so good on her. I texted him and I was like, Father, I'm ready to come home. <laughs> I wish I could go more, but the 15 hour flight does get to you at my age. Oh, yeah, I bet. It's not, well, that was a minute already? Oh, no, it was 30 seconds. One more time. So I guess Johnny was on because he heard me and he went like that. He went how? <laughs> he uh, covered his mouth with an emoji. But if you don't shop a lot, that means something's wrong. Oh, yeah. I'm feeling an empty void in my heart. That's what I say. <laughs> I fill the emptiness with luxury goods. Same. Because I need the knickknacks and the trinkets and the patty wax and the give your dog a bone. Mm-hmm. So now we're going to go in with sticker 520 because this is the cutest thing ever. For the aristocrat fantasy. E3 asks, are these the black label long sculpted stilettos? They are the one and only. <gasps> these are so cute. Oh my <laughs> god. I'm deceased. Let's give her some. She's English, so we got to give her some, some little treats, <laughs> some little cookies. Cookies and cakes. Anita Dab says, Max, do you recommend top coat before the stickers? Um, depending on the base you're doing, yes. You can either do it um, directly on the gel, but if you're gonna do it directly on the color, you need to wipe the color. So you would have to, I would recommend curing it a little bit longer than usual. So instead of 60 seconds, maybe 90 seconds to make sure it's really polymerized and then wipe it. 
with either acetone or our hand sanitizer. Look how cute she is. She's super cute. She's serving. Ozzy May said they are awesome. What kind of cat is this? Looks like an American tail, but just in a uh, short haired. Oh man, you really know your cats. I'm scared of you. I love kitties. The yeah. only one I don't like are the skinless ones. The hair, like the stinks yeah, cats or the whatever they're called? Yeah, the skinless, the hairless ones, yeah. <laughs> Ozzy may ask, any bling going on the nails? It is a Max video, love, so yes. If we didn't do any diamonds, there would be no rumors, no nastiness. And Loose Forever said, oh, those stickers are so cool. Aren't they serving? Meow, 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 meow. I gotta go behind the scenes and see all five and hundred and some stickers. Five hundred and thirty-three stickers. Oh, I couldn't decide. It is. It can be a little bit overwhelming, huh? Remember, you guys, the sticker never should reach the edge of the nail. You don't want it to overlap so that we don't have any lifting. So you can use nippers or you can use scissors and then press down firmly. You can't cut off my bruise. No. Because I don't want it to get calloused. I don't want any calluses for lovely Sarah. My heart's already calloused. It's okay. It is not. <laughs> we could do black nails next time. <laughs> for a funeral. Yes. What died, love. Yes. Black glitter, black diamonds. What's love got black to do black. with it? Got to do with it? Bow, bow, bow. Diamond Love says, love these already. Isn't she serving? These are giving me Japanese rich girl vibes. These are giving me Harajuku Barbie. Because the countries that stickers are really big in is Asia, China, um, Japan, Korea. They love their stickers. I wish America, we love stickers more, but people don't. Even though we manufacture the best stickers, hands down, stickers, unfortunately, are not that popular in the States. There's episodes, there's like seasons where stickers sell really, really well and then they go wah, wah, wah. I miss the airbrushing from back in the day. Oh, that was also a moment in time. Yeah. Airbrushing is kind of coming back, but I feel the technology is not there yet for me to um, invest in it yet. It needs to be easier to clean okay. and faster to clean. So maybe in a few years. Yeah. At that. What do you guys think? Let's do a little bouquet. Cindy Chris, she says she loves her stickers. Aren't they adorbs? And they just make nail art so fun and easy. Ooh, and then when we do all black, then we could do the those letter stickers. Oh, what are you gonna write on there? Gothic. Love, what I'm thinking? Love sucks. <laughs> I thought you were gonna put something else. Never mind. I thought you were gonna put Pasqua forever. Oh yeah, we could put Pasqua Yaki. Pasqua Pride. Yes. Amy Jewel says love them. So easy. I love stickers. Said. Cinemaca. I like that name, Cinemaca. It kind of has a, a Native American vibe to it, huh? Mm -hmm. I'm going to a little strawberry at the end. Strawberry or cookie? What do you think? Cookie! Mm -hmm. Do you like English cookies? Shortbread cookies? Yes. Me too. When I was at Disney World, I went to the English Pavilion. And um, they had uh, King Charles tin, and my mom saved it, and she put her sewing things in there. Aww. Because <laughs> I love my homeboy, Charles. Mm -hmm. That's my homie. Chuck. <clears throat> Chuck! <laughs> and, of course, the Queen of England, Camilla. Camilla Cabello. <laughs> E3 Virgo says, I have two or three sticker books, and almost probably all of your stickers for the fantasy diamond says you make this look so easy oh look at that sarah i love it 
So let's put on our little, this is our 3D Opal Charms. A little dollop of squeezy or gummy. Cinemaka said it's just my handle. That's not her name? Mm -mm. Oh. Here I was all excited. Look how beautiful that is. Mm. Okay, let's go ahead and bake that. Just 30 seconds. Luz Forever says, I have so many stickers. Make my life easy. I went, I am in a rush nails. Yes, but layering them is an art form though too. It's very laborious, but beautiful. If I can open these, there we go. Look at that. Do you think that's too much? Nothing is ever too much. That's right, especially when you're from Tucson. <laughs> more is more on the dance floor. So before I begin my embellishment of the phalanges, we're gonna go in with one coat of Queen Hard Gel Top Coat to make these nails virtually indestructible. So really focus on making sure you have a smooth, even application of Queen over the entire nail surface. And with Queen Hard Gel Top Coat, one and done. You can't, you could do two coats, but that would also make the nail a little bit too thick. Johnny Rocket said too much. Too much? Homie, what you smoking? <laughs> this is a Max video. Cinemaka asked, do you have a book for sticker storage, Max? We do, of course. It's on the website, my lovely, and it is beautiful. Johnny Rocket said no cats. What? Where are you going? Aren't you going to change? No, I'm going to Ooh. Are you coming tomorrow to work? When do we get to um, go to the studio? Whenever you want, Max. Well, whenever I get invited, a proper invitation, then I'll go. But not those kinds of half, half Naga invitations. <laughs> Johnny Rocket Rocket said Chem D. That's What's what he's that? smoking. Que says so. That says weed. Oh. <laughs> we don't talk about those things here. We've got to keep it PG, not even PG 13. That's his medicinal. For his uh, anxiety and stress. It's his anxiety tea. For partying. He's like, oh my God, what, what club are we going to go to today? Wildcat <laughs> House. The Lazy V, the um, the famous Sam's on Carnal and Valencia. My son lives down the street from the Lazy V. Really? Yes. He doesn't live with you? No. Why not? He hasn't lived with us since he became a man. Since he turned 18 or what? Uh, 22. Really? Mm -hmm. Who does he live with? With his girlfriend. But what about living at home with your mom? Oh no, he moved from there to now he lives with his girlfriend. Really? But I'm saying it's walking distance to the Lazy V. Is that why they moved there? Yeah. So then mom has a place to crash. And party. <laughs> She's like, it's walking distance, so it's safe. Johnny Rocket says the wife's dress. The wife's dress. Oh my gosh. The rumors, the nastiness, and the fantasy. <laughs> Look how beautiful these stickers are. They are serving. I can't wait to show PETA. You're like, look, you were inspiration. So I did see your story the other day where you're talking about my cat's quinceanera, and that was true. <laughs> yes. You need to send out invitations now so people can um, RSVP. Yeah, but I had a, a friend say, is she even going to be around next year? Because she's stage two. Jeez. Yes. Talk about uh, ruining somebody's party. Talk about a Debbie Downer. For reals. <laughs> I said, are you going to be around next year? With your fatty liver? <laughs> Make my little orange wood stick. 
He said, Mwah, back to work. Bye, At the John club. Rogers. Behave, sir. Got my eye on you. I know where you live in Pasqua. <laughs> Okay, turn your hand upside down for me. We're going to let itself level out for a little bit. Oh, I like his uh, thingamajiggy. Ernie? Yes. Ah, hits the spot. Okay, we can bake that now for one minute. And we're going to get our diamonds ready for the rumors and the nastiness. <laughs> Best part of the live. The diamonds. The diamonds. A kiss on the hand can be quite continental, but diamonds are a girl's best friend. You, sir, have a kitty cat on your gel brush cleaner. Is this the same kitty? Yes, that is Miss 520. That's Miss Puss? Miss Puss. <laughs> This music is making me feel like we're in a nightclub in 1999. Bringing it back. Pow, pow, pow. Diamond Love says diamonds always look so good. The more the diamonds, the closer to Jesucristo. Mm -hmm. Who was uh, on the hung on the cross today? And that's why we are celebrating Holy Thursday. Mm -hmm. And that's why I am not at work. And Sunday... He came back from the dead. Yep, in three days' time. The three, the third day he rose. Amen. Whoops. So let us begin to bling out the phalanges. White or pink? I like that one. The Blanc. Mm -hmm. So let's go in with a little bit of squeezy. Right there, so we can hide the bruise. Ah, oh, look at that! She is serving! We're gonna freeze this bad boy so that way she don't go anywhere. And then I'm gonna take a very soft file, like a 180 or a 240. If I can find it. Oh, here she is. I'm just going to refine the shape on the tip. Make sure there's no product stuck to the skin. Remove the dust. And then I'm going to apply my diamonds with gummy. Don't just tell me gummy. Here she is. Muñeca Maxi says hi. Hi, lovely. Thanks for joining us today. And then we're going to get some bling bling. Alicia Gomez is so in love. Meow, meow, meow. I'm going to do two fingers at a time because I'm going to do a lot of bling. It's perfect. i got to cheer my homegirl up. She's had a long day. Muñeca Maxi says gorge. I've had a long day too because I found out I had a fatty liver. Nina Sky says these are so cute. Loose Forever says stunning. 
And she's serving. Carousel, are you there? Oh, Gloria, tráeme diamantes del SS 10 y de 12, por favor. What do you think, sir? I love it. Okay, Kush, love them. So therapeutic to put them on, huh? Yes. The more the diamonds, the closer to the resurrection of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. Are you a cantora too or no? No. <laughs> You're like, nobody wants to hear that. In the shower, but not officially. Luz Forever says, so pretty. Uh, Diamond Love says, what are your Easter plans this weekend? That's a great question. Probably clean my room. Well, no, I have to go to Mass too, though. I gotta be a good Catholic boy. One more small one over here. I remember the priest said, even if you go to church one day a year, Easter is the best. Yep. Yes, thank you, thank you. No, no, it's not my grand. No, that's okay, thank you. Look at that, you guys. This is leaving no crumbs. Man, everybody got really quiet all of a sudden, huh? Yes. What's going on? Why did everybody get so... Everyone's just watching. I know. I was like, ¿Qué pasó? Hey, baby, ¿Qué pasó? Do you remember that song? Yeah. You that love Tejano. Thought I was your only vato. vato. Hey, baby, ¿Qué pasó? Something, something, turn around. <laughs> who, do you remember who sang that? Uh, no. Rocco3 says, Purdy meow. I need some 12. Cindy Chris says, this is the Meow Fantasy. Oh, my niece Emmeline is watching. Hi, Miss Emmelina. Shout out to Starbies. <laughs> she, oh, is that the one that works there? Yes. Emmelina Tutuli. <laughs> Diamond Love is aloeing. We're going to use some of our luxury diamonds and SS12 to help create the balance in the fantasy. Gogo -Go is watching too. Hi, lovely. Rackle 3 says, hey. Hi, mamas. Oh, look at that. Put a little stone up in here. So that way it won't get tangled in the bundles because that is not fun. We're not trying to have a Monique <laughs> Candace Dillard fight. Do you think we should put more diamonds on the flower one or leave it as is? I would put more. More? Just a few more. Just a few more. For the rumors. 
Diamond Love says the little curing light is so cute. Miss Pro Flashy Lamp, she sells like hotcakes here at inocouture.com because she is literally the best um, professional USB-C type charger lamp in the game, you guys. She is everything in a bag of chips. And remember, my lovelies, always focus your bigger diamonds towards the center of the nail to keep the shape of the nail nice and skinny mini, like she's wearing Spanx. This is a good workout gem, huh? Mm-hmm. Oh, there's a new roadhouse with Jake Gyllenhaal in it. Oh, yeah. He is jacked in it, huh? Yes. And my mom watched it, and she told me that your boyfriend comes out in it, Post Malone. <laughs> he does? Yeah. He gets beat up, I guess. I haven't seen it yet. Focus camera. Look at that. What do you guys think? Diamond Love says, she mentioned Starbucks. Has anyone tried their lavender drinks? I believe it is. I have not. Have you? I heard of them. They sound good. Because they're purple. They're purple. I like drinking colors. <laughs> it's good for my fatty liver. Yes. I have not tried it. Not myself, personally. I went twice to Starbucks today. <laughs> really? I went in the morning and I went right now before I came here. Is that why you didn't get one? Yeah. You're like, I gotta spread the love. Yours is free. Really? Yes. Because you have the points or whatever? Yes. Do they know you by name already? Not yet. Soon. Yeah. You're like, I'm getting to that point. Well, that's like I go see my niece all the time. And Johnny gets mad because I ask for her name. I'm like, is Emmeline working today? And they're like, no. Hey, we. <laughs> I did get to see her today, though. You're like, don't be such a yori. <laughs> and they're like, excuse me. And you're like, kaita to me. Luz Forever says, everything I see, your videos, I learned something new, amazing. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Estaba sonando el teléfono, Juan. ¿Lo viste? Ay, Estaba suena y suena y suena y suena. Wasn't the phone ringing like crazy, Sarah? Yes. Like somebody's life was depending on it. During and a live. During, and that is why we do not offer phone service here at inocouture.com. Tina Aubrey says, saw that last night. It was so good. I haven't even seen the original one. Oh, with the, what's his name? Patrick Swayze. Patrick Swayze. I live in a, a boy house, so we always watch men movies like Rambo and all the Fast and Furious. So I've seen the original Roadhouse. Is it good? Yes. He's sexy. Who? Uh, Patrick Swayze. Was, my dear. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think that's enough. Cindy Chris said, I tried the matcha latte lavender drink. It was, it is so good. Cindy approved, so we need to check it out then. Totsi Totsi says, hi, everyone. Hi, lovely. Okay, let's bake these bad boys now. One minute. Diamond Love says, not yet. <laughs> They're giving me coquette vibes. I love it. Ozzy Mate says, can you please explain the different gel glue, excuse me, different gel glues you use? I get confused. What do you get confused on, my love? Maybe that'll be easier for me to... Um, expand on the the fantasy
let me know. And then we're gonna seal with a little bit of liquid gum. I need, actually need a new one. Cause this one's kinda empty. Uh oh. Ozzy asks, which ones are best to hold down the crystal? They're all the same. So they're all made with the same raw materials. The biggest difference is the viscosity of the products. So some are thicker than others. So I use all of them in conjunction with each other to make sure they last a long time too. Because especially like if they move a lot, it not move a lot, but like if your um, client or yourself are really um, active with your hands, it's really important to have all of them. So that way you can have all your bases covered because bigger diamonds require thicker gel or something that has a thicker viscosity versus a smaller diamond, which really doesn't need something too big. And then we're going to go in with liquid gummy and we're only going to apply it to the edges, the outer parts of the rhinestones to make sure it doesn't tangle. And I like to do two thin coats to make sure it's really sealed, okay? Nails and hair girl says those nails are beautiful. Oh, thank you. It's because the model is beautiful. So they go hand in hand with each other. Alicia Gomez says, do you use two different glues for the diamonds? I do. So I'm going in first. I went with regular gummy gel. And this one is called liquid gummy. And this is a no wipe gel that has this precision needle tip applicator that I'm applying to the edges of the stone so that way they don't get tangled. And I'm going to do two thin coats to make sure they don't get tangled. And notice how I didn't put the diamonds all the way to the edges. This also helps ensure longevity. Ozzy made said thank you. You're welcome, my lovely. Class by Deja said, oh my God, these are so cute and coquette. Can't believe I didn't join earlier. Oh, that's okay. We still have to do our IG live and this one will be saved as well too. So that way you can watch it later, my lovely. See, I'm using just the tip of the liquid gummy to get all those edges. And you, if you're not that hard on your nails, you can do one coat, that should be enough. But Simply Sarah, she does a lot of upside down twerking at the boat. Yeah. So we got to accommodate that to make sure that she doesn't have any issues with her phalanges. Cindy Chris said TikTok next. That's right. And honestly, the nails did not take that long. I think the design took definitely longer than the nails, huh? Oh yeah. Easy. Diamond Love Nail says, always enjoy your lives. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Okay, let's bake this now. 30 seconds. Great, they already started a drama on my Facebook, you guys. <laughs> They're talking about the cradle blade that comes in the pedicure pack. I'm like, it's not illegal, actually. You can do it on yourself. And different <laughs> state boards actually have updated their policies that you can use them for beautification purposes. So when someone says they're illegal, they're actually not, because if they were illegal, they wouldn't be sold. And it's up to the buyer's discretion if they want to use it or not. Same with diet pills. <laughs> True. It's the fools that make the, the trouble, not the tools. Rocco3 says, you guys are a great team. That's because she's a ride or die. She's an OG from Pasqua. What, what? And Anna Melinda says, pink army in the house. 520. Anita Dab says, exactly. Cindy Chris says, people are pretending to know everything. For reals. And you know what I do? I just delete the comment. Because I'm not going to have an argument with somebody on the internet. That was the old Mac. That was, what does J-Lo say? This is me then. <laughs> this is me now. Your comment just gets deleted. Because honestly, I have too many things to worry about in my life than, you know, arguing with somebody over the internet. If you want to argue with somebody on the internet, I mean, 
We all have our moments. I know I do. But not today. Especially today. Today is... Holy Thursday. Yes, exactly. Not today, Satan. Not today, said Satan. <laughs> Oh, beautiful. Diamond Love says, I know, I love how you read that pink army comment. Which one? And then DSS Nail says, not today. Not today. Maybe tomorrow. Or no, maybe next week. It's Holy Week. Have some respect. Respecto. Por favors. DSS said, those are beautiful. She is serving us the Coquette Barbie Fantasy. And we're going to cure this final layer of liquid gummy for one whole minute. Bake it for a minute. Aristocrats. Meow. <laughs> Is it a cute cartoon? Yes. That's when Disney was doing really bad in the 70s, it I think. It was. I just remember I liked Marie. And she's a little, like, stuck up tail in the air. She's my type of spirit She's you animal. as a cat. Yeah, she's my spirit animal. Let's bake that now for one minute. I personally have never seen it. But I know Disney made a lot of weird movies in the 70s. Yeah. Like the cat that came from outer space or that dumb cat. What was it called? Yeah, the cat from outer space. The cat from outer space was one I of like the 70s. Tron was also from the 70s. Yeah. Um, there was a lot of smoking in those uh, conference rooms. <laughs> Watcher in the Woods. <gasps> that one scares me. Really? Uh, Narek. It's Remember? so... It was carrying backwards. And the little girl wrote it on the window, and it said Narek. And now she's on The Real House of Beverly Hills. Is she? That's Kyle Richards. Oh, my God. I did not put that together. Mm -hmm. And Betty Davis. That was one of the last movies she did. And Kyle Richards also comes out in the... the what is it? The Escape 13th? to Witch Mountain. No, that's her sister, Kim Friday Richards. The yes. No, uh, Halloween. Halloween. She was very pretty back then. Well, now she looks... Like everybody else in Beverly Hills. She's a little different looking. She's a little pooled and a little plumped. I heard that if you have uh, fillers in your lips and they don't look like they're um, in there, that you can start pulling on your lips towards forward like a duck mouth. Mm -hmm. And that'll bring One more it time. all back. Because you know how you said that it migrates? Yes. So that's how you pull it back. So they have that thing that it, it's like a little T-shaped thing that yeah. you massage it to keep it in one place. Yes. But filler does migrate. Well, they say that if you do it in the shower, like in the like a hot shower, and just pull on your lips and bring all the filler forward, it'll mm -hmm. bring back the, the puffy look. That's why people keep doing it over and over and over because they want it to look how it is. Yeah, when they it's... think it's gone, but it's not. Mm-hmm. You just gotta pull on them lips like Donald Duck. Because if it gets puffy, the space between the you lip and the nose, like this. If the lips get puffy between the, where the lip and the nose is, that's when it looks like a uh, orangutan's vagine. Oh yeah. When it's like smooth and poofy here, yeah, it's not cute. No mm -hmm. gracias. No. Tequila Thursday, babes. Not for us. Mm -mm. We are good Catholics mm -hmm. on this side of the camera. Not gonna sin today. Not maybe tomorrow. Or Sunday. Some people are already. No, no, no. No, 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 no. After Sunday. On Monday. Yes. Okay. These bad boys ain't going anywhere. We're going to let the nail finish the polymerization process. So we wait 10 seconds. And then we're going to hit it with cotton candy cuticle oil. And she is serving us aristocrat uh, Mexican non-union equivalent. <laughs> <laughs> Rainita says my friend had silicone injections and it migrated badly she had a few sessions of wood therapy and it all went back to its place mm -mm. but so you should never inject silicone in your face though that is not bueno mama does nail said hey Matt. hi lovely thanks for joining us today nails by chris said beautiful i just want you to know you're my favorite girl. Mama does nails. It's so beautiful. Do you love it? These nails are... They are the moment. Just a few little diamonds. Very small ones. Very basic. 
Spread in the post fantasy. <laughs> and her name is Peta. What do you guys think? Do you love it? Very simple design. Get some good lighting up in here. Ooh. Beautiful. Well, my lovelies, that is a wrap for today's demo. These nails are for the gracious living, as Mama said. Two plain. I agree. We need more. <laughs> More is more. And do you see why I didn't do a glitter base? Because do you see everything that we put on? If we did a glitter base, it would just lose everything. We need that contrast. It's all about creating balance in the fantasy. And I hope you guys loved it. We're going to head on over to TikTok, do the other hand. And we'll be back tomorrow with Karen Monaco in the next live video. Bye, everybody.